Hey guys, Kevin here from Aqua Reefs, and today I'm going to show you guys how to lay out the gravel in your fish tank. So, as you've probably seen my other video before, I had a video on how to clean the gravel or substrate on your tank, and uh, what should I call it? I have my uh, crushed coral that I used in the previous video, and here it is right here, all clean and ready to go. And uh, what should I call it? You're going to want to use something like this. A cutting board or maybe a piece of flat glass or whatever anything like this shape where you can kind of flatten something like a surface because that's what we're going to be doing with the gravel guys we're going to be uh, pretty much flattening out the gravel as we put it in the tank so I'm gonna put the camera down here and I am going to hopefully you guys can see this my apologies, I'm using my iPod Touch. It's not that good when it comes to standing. Alright, so I am going to remove the lid, or hood, whatever you guys want to prefer to call it. Scoot this on over here. Get this out of here. There we go. Okay. So I'm going to dig out some coral. Crush coral. Make sure I don't drop anything. And I am going to lay it down nicely in the tank. Just like that. Make sure everything's evened out. And just keep repeating the process. Do another. Get another one here. And that's basically all you have to do. You don't have to do any flattening or anything at the time. Basically, all you want to do is get your gravel or substrate into the tank. And um, as you can see, this obviously is the fish tank that I'm using. It's a 20-gallon fish tank. And uh, I have an AquaClear 200 filter. And I have the underground gravel filter, as you guys can see. I have the heater, and I have my instant ocean salt. And I am all set to go, and I am very excited. So I will be right back, guys, and I will get the video ready for the next step to show you guys. Be right back. Okay, guys, so I'm back here. I got my gravel filled in. It may not be enough exactly, but just to give you guys an example of what you got to do. So I got my hood on so you guys can see the gravel and see what I'm doing. What I'm going to do here is I'm just going to simply just flatten this out. Like I said, this may not be enough, but this is just to show you guys what you gotta do. And I won't lie, this is a little bit tricky. <laughs> but it's definitely coming out nice. Okay, I'm trying to do this without banging up the tank. Basically, this is all you really got to do is just continue to go back and forth with this process. There we go. And this is basically it. This is all you gotta do. Just flatten it out. Just do that over there. Fill up your corners. And I am almost done, guys.
so basically, as you just saw what I did, I took a uh, cutting board and I simply just used it to flatten out my gravel. And this is how it comes out. And you can obviously make it come out better. But this was just an example to show you guys what you had to do. And I still have leftover crushed coral. It's a good thing I saved my bags. But guys, that is it. Um, this is my second video I made. I will, my next video, I'm hoping I can show you guys my fish. I have a grouper that I caught on my marine science field trip. I'm going to bring that into my tank. And uh, I'll show you guys that next. So um, this is Kevin again from Aqua Reefs. Um, any suggestions on any videos you guys want with uh, reef tanks or anything? Uh, I basically got all the answers because my dad used to own a 150-gallon uh, saltwater reef tank back a long time ago. So he can just tell me anything you guys ask. And I'll tell you guys. So, thanks for watching, and hope you continue watching the rest of my videos. Peace out, guys.